guys? I am here with Hollywood Undead. What's up, guys? You want to go around and introduce yourselves one by one? Sure. Johnny Three Tears. This is J-Dog. And this is the Curls. All right. All right. <laughs> All right. So I'd like to start off with your coming in hot video that just came out like two, three days ago. And it's looking really hot, to say the least. Um, when you were making that video personally, what, were you, what was going through your head? Because it's a totally <laughs> different... It was just funny. And all that. No, I know. It's just the irony of the whole thing. Yeah, um, we were, what was going through our heads there, fellas? We were just uh, wanting some fruit. Maybe, they wanted to bang my daughters in the video. Really? Well, they were like my... Do it was play daughters, not my real daughters. Acting daughters. Acting daughters. I don't know. The same thing as any video. There's nothing really going through your head because you drank too much alcohol to really realize what you're doing. Whoop, whoop. Whoop, whoop. We'd be clubbing. Somebody, act somebody. So, uh, no, just do it. It's like it's like any video. You know, you get into your character, what you're doing, and then you're just partying, basically. So, I mean, half the time, I was like, what? Why am I on a farm with facial hair on my face? So, maybe that was going through my head sometimes, but it was fun. Every video is fun to film. That was fun because there's girls dancing around and we're drinking. It's definitely different than what we've, what we've done before. Yeah, that's why I asked specifically on this video because it was a different concept completely, pretty much. Yeah. It was really cool. Well, we've already, we already done like other videos so many times that we thought it was time to do something a little different, you know, show our acting skills off a little more, and that's how that came out. And do you have a story behind the mask? The mask? We just wanted to wear them because it looks different, and... We felt that uh, if you wear a mask, it looks cool visually, so we do that. We don't wear them for the whole show. We take them off like halfway through, so we just thought it looked cool. And, you know, take photos, it still looks cool. Fucking looks dope. Fucking looks dope. Yeah, and the new masks are like even better. Yeah, this is, he, he uh, this was the engineer behind them all. Yeah, they got lights in them. Actually, all three of us are the ones sitting here that have lights in them, so they're dope. You know, thank you. Uh, me on the fly, I was just sitting at uh, J Dog and Johnny Three Tears apartment back in the day, and it just, I had curly hair and I still do, and it, there wasn't much thought into it. I just named myself, and everyone has just been making fun of me ever since. <laughs> but it works. That's good. And Jay is, you know, J Dog, man. But you know what's funny, though, is this is the only guy I know that actually keeps giving himself nicknames throughout his whole life. Like, normally you don't nickname yourself. He let other people do it, but he keeps nicknaming himself. So I don't even know. He's bad, man. He's cool like that. No, I just don't even know if I could take his name serious. Yeah. I agree with what Jay just said. Can't give yourself a nickname. Um, Three Tears was the name of uh, our first band. Mm -hmm. So that's where it came from. My real first name is Johnny, so Johnny Three Tears. No, okay. it's gangster rap. Like, oh, I always been to a... So what if we feel things? Is that bad now? Is it wrong of us to feel something? I think it's more manly, personally. That sounds like a bitch shit to me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's a different record. I mean, we recorded different kinds of songs for it and stuff. We wanted to uh, branch out in one degree or another and kind of grow as a band. I know that stuff all sounds cliche, but it's all true. It's like, you know, when you're writing another record... You don't want to. We didn't want to write Swan Songs Part Two. You know, it was all about um, keeping it interesting for ourselves and the fans. And so we branched out, wrote some different kind of material. We'll continue to do so. We love to experiment with everything. Yeah, music, drugs, sweetie pussy. For me personally, uh, I don't want to die. Is my favorite at the moment. But you know, honestly, since. We, I have, you know, we have all the songs, obviously, but it changes. Mother Murder is one off the deluxe that I, I love. Um, I like a lot of songs, but my favorite at the moment is I Don't Want to Die, but it changes, like, you know, every day, depending on how emo I am. Uh, I love all the songs, man. I think they're all just fantastic. <laughs> I'm just getting so emo, I'm getting choked up over here. Uh, like, I Don't Want to Die and My Town both completely different but I think they're both very great in their own sense I'd have to agree with them and I also love I Don't Want to Die and I love My Town and I like Skava a lot actually I was listening to it at my bunk last night all crazy drunk buzzed high as freaking hell 
Yeah. I, I took one of those Jeffries from that movie where you're rubbing things or something. <laughs> Next question. Okay. I wouldn't want them. I would take away whatever uh, whatever message that they construe, but I'd more want them to give something instead of taking it away. You know, a lot of people take from bands; they don't give back enough. We live a very uh, rough life. We don't. We're not rich. We are good looking, but that's a totally different story. So. God, yeah, God gave us that, not the fans. <laughs> um, I mean, I'm not going to get my specific beliefs, but, uh, you know, I definitely believe in things that are going on besides what we see and stuff like that. And, um, but, you know, I keep those things personal. How about you? I am personally a believer in Jesus. You love the Jesus. I love the Jesus. We love the Jesus. We love the right on. I, hey, I respect all beliefs. You got to. That's one thing I respect. That's the only, th- the only thing I respect besides pussy. God and pussy. Yeah. We, we we've moved on with our career. You know, yeah. we're still we're just making music and playing shows, and that's kind of the end of that story. No, yeah, we're gonna keep doing what we're doing. We play and tour and put out new records, like any man does. Keep eating pussy. Keep pussy going. No, the sleeping for me. The sleeping. Uh, yep. Um, Slayer. 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 Your favorite song to perform live? For me, um, <laughs> been to hell right now for me. Yeah. I'm having a lot of fun with been to hell. We're gonna wrap it up here with Hollywood Undead. You guys got any last words to say to your fans? Finger bang my balls. Learn your English. Uh, check out our tour dates, the Revolt Tour. We're on tour right now. If you want to come see the show, the upgrade from the last one, Revolt Tour. You can go buy our record, American Tragedy. All right, check it out with Hollywood Undead. Undead. <laughs> Hollywood Undead. <laughs> Hollywood Undead. <laughs> Later. Hollywood Undead. <laughs>